Hey, Singers from the Hidden Levels here with part 4 of Enigma This Ghost to uh, Maple Creek uh, walkthrough for Xbox One. Um, just as a reminder, I am playing this walkthrough on uh, normal difficulty. I recommend you play on expert difficulty if you just want to go through the game just once for the full 1000. The only difference between the normal and expert is that um, after like 5 mistakes on expert, the uh, hidden object scenes grow go a little bit fuzzy, making you have to wait a couple secs. And um, the uh, objects in the uh, actual puzzle, actual walking around scenes don't glow, so you'll have to actually click on them. But with the walkthrough, um, don't really have to think about any of that. It's all done for you. So uh, I, r I recommend you start playing on expert straight away, um, <coughs> and also don't skip any mini games or use uh, hints on puzzles in uh, hidden object scenes, as there are achievements for finishing all of the puzzles, uh, all of the mini games, and all the hidden object scenes without using hints and uh, without uh, skipping. If you do accidentally use hint or uh, skip a puzzle. Um, you can actually start a new game and complete uh, as many uh, hidden object scenes or uh, puzzles that you skipped and uh, that will also complete the achievement. It, you, you can do the same one over and over. All right, I'm struggling a little bit. Just look at the, um, the letters that's your hints on how to do this. I don't think this puzzle changes at all. So you can also just look at where I'm p placing stuff and uh, uh, look for similar shaped ones and put them there. When you put it down in the right place, it does lock in. So uh, you'll know for sure that you got it right. that's it I completed the puzzle that is another I believe that's another evidence or it tells me where to go next now open up this evidence thing and put the uh, some the evidence that I'm dragging um, to these the right places and they open up new stuff you okay. we'll, we'll go back a little bit back to this house and enter through the window and then we will solve this I'm oh, sorry maybe I that was a mistake sorry go back and use this hidden object scene solve this and uh, we will get an item that we can use for the next part I'm just clicking everywhere on export as I mentioned it will uh, lock you up for a couple of seconds but still it's very easy um, even if you have to actually look for them that's the whole point of this game anyway so might as well enjoy it just wanted to uh, get the puzzle done as quickly as possible so I can uh, make this video as short as possible as well We'll keep going back all the way out to here, which is your room. Another hidden object puzzle, uh, same thing. I'm just clicking everywhere trying to solve this. Done. All right. Now 
go back out okay, now go to the your car and check the trunk or the hood not the trunk and use the container thing to get some acid battery acid now go towards the tower and we'll solve this puzzle and click on that bird pick up that evidence and zoom in there hopefully we we'll use the acid hmm, maybe not yeah, use the hammer to fix it and now we can climb up here put a coin in there Now we're going to clean the lens a little bit. There you go. Now <coughs> just um, adjust the settings to where I point. And uh, focus in using the uh, focus thing. Okay, that's the first one. Got one more. And that's it. Done. towards the tree throw the rope go in there and we'll climb up and there's a bell here that we're gonna use the acid to make drop Somehow that bell was controlling the townsfolk, I guess, and uh, you released him. Now go downstairs, pick that up. Another hidden object scene. Not much to say, I mean, uh, hidden object scenes are random, so. Uh, the object that you have to find uh, changes so even if I tell them tell you where each object is um, yeah you're not gonna get the same list so it doesn't really matter okay now that you have a compass we're gonna be able to navigate through the woods talk to this guy first though Go down into the basement. Wait, not yet. Sorry. We need to solve the candle puzzle to get down there. We don't have one of the candles, I think. But we did find the murder weapon.
Okay, go back a couple of times. Now we go into the woods. Now with the compass, this is a random again. You have to follow the north side, either right or left. Wherever the compass says N, just go that way. So uh, on my screen here, I go right, left, left. And then right. And we end up here. You should end up at the same place if you follow the north. Okay, pick up that evidence. Okay, pick that thing up on the ground. Now on the right side there, use the uh, branch. And we can pick this up. The lock picks. Now go there to the house, the cabin. And pick that uh, thing up first. Go into the cabin. There's a guy. Talk to him. We have the candle, the last candle that we need. Take the sausage as well. We're gonna need it to distract the dog at the farmhouse now go back a couple times to the tree go left towards the chapel church I think it's called the church now we can open this as we have the candles that we need Arrange it though exactly as I arrange it, just move the candles. And uh, that opens the door. Go downstairs. Hidden object puzzle. I'm having trouble finding that last one. It's usually the case with these kind of puzzles that you find everything and you just can't seem to find that last one. That's what's going on here. So, sometimes it's at a really obvious place and I just... Just missing it. Um, Sometimes it's really well hidden. So there we go. Look at this thing. Uh, take down all the papers, and it'll reveal that thing in the in the back, and also some uh, some stuff. There we go. We got an evidence out of that. We're gonna be opening this later, but not not yet. We don't have the items that we need. Open up the evidence thing as we got one, a couple more evidence here. And we can complete this. There we go, we another page filled. Okay, just uh, and that's it. That's it for this chapter. Thank you for watching. Uh, I'll be back with more videos soon.